spending our weekend uh, in the Loire Valley uh, area, which is uh, pretty close to Paris uh, and uh, home to the UNESCO World Heritage Site and around uh, 300 castles. Of course, we will not be able to visit all uh, 300 castles in uh, just two days. So we decided to stop by uh, the Royal Castle of Amboise. Uh, Royal Castle of uh, Blois and uh, two other smaller but uh, still very interesting and very important castles uh, in the area. And also we are going to stop by three cities with very rich uh, history and beautiful architecture. This is a tree which apparently was planted by Napoleon Bonaparte uh, about 200 years ago. Loire is one of the rivers which is not controlled by artificial uh, dams and it may seem uh, calm and uh, quiet right now but uh, it has uh, unpredictable flow uh, of water which makes it not suitable for river navigation.
Kalahari Valley has uh, literally hundreds of uh, castles, chateaus, uh, beautiful towns and other very interesting places. So the question arises, uh, what is the reason behind this? Why there is so much history in one place? And I think uh, the question is not that difficult to answer. Uh, Loire historically has been uh, uh, of high strategic importance. So even in Middle Ages, the nobility started to build some castles along the river banks. Uh, but even more importantly, during the 100-year war between uh, England and France, uh, the French uh, lost a lot of territory and they decided to move to this area. They, this was a, their stronghold. And they did not just uh, stay put in one place. Uh, they moved around uh, along the valley. And in order to do that, they needed to build uh, several castles to uh, house the king and the entourage. Even after the war ended, they decided to stay here because the area was very nice. There were lots of uh, hunting of opportunities in the forests. And uh, on top of that, the river made it easier to move goods around. So this also facilitated the construction. In addition to that, uh, it was easy to extract some materials uh, to build uh, the chateaus. And uh, together with the power to this area moved lots of uh, nobility because they wanted to be close to the king. And that continued even after the court moved back to Paris. And uh, now the chateaus are here, they could not just disappear and they continued to attract uh, lots of visitors. And this area deservedly got the UNESCO World Heritage Site nomination.